and welcome to the February Student of the Month here on LDTV. I am your host, Josh Gladson. Our first Student of the Month for the month of February is freshman Tatiano Estime. Congratulations being Student of the Month. Thank you. So why do you think you were selected as Student of the Month? Well, like, I always try to be nice to people, right? Because I feel bad, like, I feel bad if I don't hold doors for people, so I go out of my way to always be nice to people. What do you evolve with here at Cherokee? What do you like to do outside of school? Well, I just read a lot and do my homework. You like and to read? I got with my friends, yeah. Uh, what type of books are you into? Uh, mostly fantasy. Fantasy? Yeah, fa fantasy fiction, those are very interesting books. I like it because it's, like, it's not realistic and it's just fun. Uh, so what advice do you have to freshmen like yourself or just anyone in general? Always try to be nice to people. Always try to be nice to people? Yeah. Uh, what do you, why do you think kindness is important to you? Because, like, because, like, that's just how I was, like, taught to treat people. All right, next question. Uh, who inspired you the most, or, like, what's your uh, number one source of inspiration? Uh, my older sister. Why is that? Because, like, she's always nice to people. She's always nice to people also? Yeah. So I guess kindness runs in your family? Yeah. Well, that's very nice. Next question. I know you're only a freshman, so it's going to be a little hard for you to answer. Uh, What's your favorite memory here at Cherokee, or uh, what's something that you're looking forward in the future? Well, I'm looking forward to senior year. Why's that? Because like the Disney trip mostly. As you said earlier, you like to read and hang out with your friends. Uh, what else do you like to do in your free time? Well, play video games mostly. Uh, what type of video games are you into? Like Naruto Storm 4 and like Overwatch. Oh, that's very, oh, those are very, I heard Overwatch was a fun game. And a lot of people that are into that. And our last question, uh, I know this is going to be a little hard for you to answer since you're only a freshman, but uh, what are your plans for after high school? Well, I'll be planning on go I'm planning on going to college, and then after that, like, traveling. Travel, you want to see the world? Yeah. Uh, is there something in college you want to major in, or are you not sure yet? Um, probably writing, or like video game design. Game designing? Well, that's a very interesting career. Congratulations for being student of the month, and thank you for coming down. Thank you. Our next student of the month for the month of February is sophomore Kara Rosner. Congratulations for being student of the month. Thank you. So why do you think you were selected as student of the month? I believe that I was um, selected because I try to help others as much as I can. In classes, if they're struggling, I always offer people help. And um, I really try my best to get the best grades that I can. Next question. Uh, so what are you involved with here at Cherokee? Um, I'm in Renaissance Club, a Smack Club, and then I also do the plays here, and I'm in choir. Hmm. So uh, can you tell me a little bit about the uh, Spring Musical that's going on here? Uh, for the Spring Musical, we're doing Anything Goes, and it's about um, two people. They're um, kind of in love, but there's like some conflicts in the way. It's like a romantic comedy, so yeah. Okay, so uh, what role do you play in the Anything Goes? I'm just in the ensemble. Okay, very nice. Uh, next question. Uh, what advice do you have to underclassmen or just anyone in general? I think that people should not procrastinate and always try their best in whatever subject. Um, don't think about like the future. Just focus on now and yeah, just to work hard. Very good, yeah, procrastinating is a problem for literally almost everyone. I do it all the time and I know yeah. I shouldn't. <laughs> and next question, uh, who inspires you the most or uh, what's your uh, number one source of inspiration? My source of inspiration is probably music. Um, I've always been into music since I was little and that's a really big thing in my life. So. Yeah. Uh, what type of music are you into? Uh, all kinds, I listen to everything. So you're just like whatever's on the radio I'll listen to? Yeah. That's very good. Yeah, music can be very um, inspiring for a lot of people. Um, next question, uh, what teacher do you think nominated you for Student of the Month? I believe that it was my geometry teacher, Miss Melagrana, because that's the class that I talk in the most and I'm good at math so I always help people in that class. Uh, Ms. Mulgrand is a great teacher. I had her when I was a soft, very enthusiastic. Yeah. I, and she made geometry a blast. Um, so, so far in your two years here at Cherokee, uh, what's your favorite memory? Being in the plays is like a really great thing. Everyone there is like really nice and I feel like we create like a family. 
So my first two shows freshman year were a really great memory because I met so many new people and everyone was so nice. So I don't think I'll ever forget that. Yeah. Uh, what was your, out of all the shows you've done, which one has to be your favorite? Um, probably High School Musical because that was really fun for me. All the ensembles that I was in, we danced a lot and it was a good time. Uh, I saw High School Musical, it was really good. Um, uh, next question for you, uh, what do you enjoy to do in your free time? Uh, well, I take dance classes outside of school. Um, I mean, I dabble in like sports like that I play with my friends, but besides that, that's really it. Okay, very nice. And our last question, I know you don't have to worry about this for a couple more years, but uh, what, are you, what are your plans for after high school? I definitely want to get out of New Jersey, um, probably go to like California, somewhere like there. Uh, not really sure of my major yet, but... Yeah. You just wanted like a new scene, like West Coast vibe type thing? Yeah. Yeah, California's a nice place, I heard. Okay, well, congratulations for being student of the month. Thank you. Thank you for coming down. Our next student for February student of the month is junior Jack Walters. Congratulations for being student of the month. Thank you. So why do you think you were nominated as student of the month? I think I was nominated because I participate a lot in class and I help my fellow students learn and be able to grasp the concepts in classes. Yeah, very interesting. Uh, what, are you what are you involved with here at Cherokee? Um, I'm on the football and baseball team and I also participate in National Honor Society and Peer Leaders Club. Okay, so uh, for football, what position do you play? I play linebacker. And what exactly is a linebacker? It's a defender and tackle people that come at you. Ah, oh, so you can do the fun stuff. Exactly. And then uh, what about for baseball? Baseball, I play infield, mostly second base. Um, and what exactly is the uh, Peer Leaders Club? Peer Leaders Club is a club that um, you have to be nominated for, and we do a lot of social recreation with the special ed students and other community service around the community and school. Oh, sounds like a very nice club to be part of. All right, next question. Uh, what advice do you have to underclassmen or just anyone in general? not be um, isolated. It's a great community. That's true. Cherokee is a very great community. Uh, next question. Uh, who inspires you the most or like what's your uh, number one source of inspiration? I think my parents inspire me the most. They motivate me a lot and they provide for me to become who I want to be. Well, that's very nice. I hope your parents watch and hear you say that. <laughs> um, next question. Uh, what teacher do you think nominates you for Student of the Month? I think Ms. Rabinowitz, my chemistry teacher, nominated me because I participate a lot in that class and I have a good relationship with her. Do you enjoy chemistry a lot? I do. So uh, what's your uh, favorite mer memory here at Cherokee or uh, something that you're looking forward to in the future? Uh, I think I'm looking forward a lot to senior year, my last year playing sports and Disney and prom. Disney World, I, I believe it's like 30 something days away. I, I, I honestly can't wait for it. It's going to be a trip of a lifetime. Uh, next question, uh, what do you enjoy to do in your free time? Uh, in my free time, I play sports. I also watch a lot of TV shows on Netflix and HBO, and I read a lot. And uh, last question, uh, what do you plan to do after high school? I plan to attend college. I don't um, want to go too far away, stay local, and um, definitely major in something math and science, because that's what I enjoy. That's very, that's very nice. Uh, congratulations for being through the month. Thank you. Thank you for coming down. Our final student of the month for the month of February is Senior Dylan Rhodes. Congratulations on being student of the month. Thank you. So why do you think you were selected as student of the month? I think I was selected because uh, I was walking in the hallway and I found some money. And uh, when I picked up the money, I decided to return it to the office. And uh, I think uh, a lot of teachers just noticed that it would have been very easy for me to just walk away with it because it's just laying there on the ground. Now, how much money was it? Was it like 20 or something? Uh, or? It was just $15. $15? Yeah. That's actually a, pretty, a lot of money, actually. Yeah, I mean, if it was outside of school, I mean, it's not that much money, but since it was inside, I mean, that could have been someone's lunch or something, so. Yeah, that's true. Just could be to make sure. All right, next question. Uh, what's your involvement here at Cherokee? Um, I play lacrosse for the uh, lacrosse team. Lacrosse is definitely the uh, best one I'm at. That's what I'm going to college for. That's nice. And then uh, you're going to be doing lacrosse again this year, I assume, right? Yep. It's very definitely. interesting. So what position do you play in lacrosse? I uh, play defense in LSM, which is kind of like a, uh, LSM is like a midi, but I have like that six foot long uh, stick. So I just bounce in between there, wherever I'm really needed. 
Okay, that sounds like a pretty vital part of the like, team. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Need defense. Uh, next question. Uh, what advice do you have to underclassmen or just anyone in general? You know, do the right thing even when no one's looking around because, uh, you know, like good things happen to good people. And I mean, just have a positive attitude really because it's just going to make everything a lot better. Who inspires you the most or like what's your uh, number one source of inspiration? Uh, probably my dad, honestly. And why is that? Because he's, he's the hardest working man I've ever seen in my life. And, uh, you know, he's just, he works seven days a week just to, you know, keep the family, get, get the money and all that. And uh, he's just, he's just all around a great guy. And I just want to grow up being just like him. So he's been my inspiration since I was younger. Wow, it's very nice of you to say that. Yeah. I'm sure he'll appreciate that when he watches this later on. Our next question, uh, what teacher do you think nowadays you for student of the month? That's a tough one because, uh, I, like I said, it was like in the hallway and the just teachers all around. So honestly, it could have been anyone. Um, it could have been the teacher that uh, helped me meet the girl who, uh, whose money it was. So, Do you happen to know who that teacher was? Uh, I can't remember her name, honestly. It was just real brief, but it uh, turned out that it was her uh, field trip money. So when I did meet her, I, I felt a lot better that she uh, got to get that money in. Well, that's, that's very lucky of her and mm -hmm. very nice of you, of course. Hey, you'll find out in May uh, who now needs you, yep. the award ceremony. Uh, next question, out of your four years so far, what's your favorite memory? Favorite memory, I would, I would say uh, probably sophomore year was uh, during lacrosse season. We got to go, uh, it's my first year playing varsity. We got to go to the uh, championship against Lenape. I mean, even though they came out on top 8-6, it was just all around a great experience. You know, I've never played in that many, like in front of that many people before. It was just really just, it was fantastic. Yeah, you, you know that unfortunately we lost. Great game at least, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Still yeah. a fun experience to remember, yep. I bet. Going to remember it for the rest of my life. Uh, next question, besides doing everything in school and lacrosse and everything, uh, what do you enjoy to do in your free time? Um, my free time? I like to ride my motorcycle a lot. I mean, got that, well, I got that uh, two summers ago, just got a new one and you know, it's just great because it's a good way to like clear my head. Anything's going on. What type of motorcycle do you got? I got a 2005 Suzuki Hayabusa. Uh, what are your plans for after high school? I'm going to be going to college. I'm going to be going to uh, Hood College. It's in Frederick, Maryland. It's like two and a half hours from here. And uh, I'm going there. I can't really decide right now from uh, special education or uh, law enforcement. So I'm going to kind of, I'm going to double major there, see what I like, and hopefully something comes from it. Okay, uh, that's very interesting. Uh, congratulations for being Student of the Month. Thank you. Thank you for coming down. That'll do it for this edition of Students of the Month here on LDTV. For all of us here in the studio, I'm Josh Gladstone. See you next time here on Students of the Month.